So I am here with Daniel from Crunch Fitness and we're gonna go and visit Crunch and we're gonna talk a little bit about all the New Year's resolutions that we made. Maybe we're in a slump right now because I mean it is almost March. We're gonna talk about how to kind of reignite that motivation. You need to get back on the horse. Today's the day. Today's the day. So we're gonna take the Chevy Equinox out and we're gonna go head on down to Crunch Fitness. This is Corey, and today we're making content for Richard Lucas Chevrolet and Crunch. It's a very exciting day. We have a lot going on. Push button start. No keys. Push button start. I have to say, I actually really like the push button start feature. Oh, that is pretty cool, actually. There's no Apple CarPlay in my car. Your next car needs Apple CarPlay. Okay, I see that there's a messages. Can I answer text messages from here? Yes, you can. Are you serious? While I'm driving? It'll read it to you and it'll say, do you want to reply? And then you just say yes, and they'll say, what do you want to say? That's actually great that you can reply using your voice while you're driving. That's a really nice feature. My favorite part about it is because I'm directionally challenged. Yeah, it's true. It's bad. I would be lost without my Google Maps. So here it has your Google Maps right from your phone and you can set it on your phone. And then once your Apple CarPlay comes on, you just hit Maps, you hit your location, and boom, it's right there. Wait, so can you listen to audiobooks as well? I see an yes. audio icon there. Mm, I'm deep on some books right now. I'm yeah. Actually... This has Android Auto also. Oh, nice. For the rest yeah. of us. For all you Android users, yes. So how come you <laughs> don't go to the gym? Because kids? Because kids. Kids, because this is gonna suck what I'm gonna say next. But 6 a.m. is the time. Like I hate to say it like that because 6 a.m. it's dark, it's cold. But like once April comes, 6 a.m. it's late out. You know what I mean? You got to use the early morning hours to like kind of. My husband does that. Yeah. He's crazy. It sucks, but it, it does work. <laughs> like if I say, oh, I'm gonna go after work, I'm probably not. My wife's gonna call me and be like, oh, we need to go food shopping, or like, oh, we need to do laundry or something, and I'm probably not gonna get in. You know. That's true. When I'm in total like gym mode, it has to be done first thing in the morning. That's the way I'm most successful, is just to get it out of the way. Now, when you work out, are you like a treadmill person or elliptical or like workout class, weights? What kind of person? Oh, we're gonna get into my treadmill story because I remember I told you about that. So I started out as a treadmill girl. Then I then I moved on to an elliptical. But I really find that the classes motivate me. If I can find like a really good class that's not gonna be like a little over my head because I mm. don't like that. Mm. That's just not motivate me. Mm. Have you ever taken a class and maybe it's like the first time you took it and there's a bunch of old people in the class who are legit like killing it and you're like, you're 80 years old and I'm barely keeping up. Yes. What am I doing wrong with my life? What else do you find helps you when you're like really in a slump, like just getting re motivated so I look online at all the people who are in much better shape than me and I say Dan you gotta do it you can't just let these people win I, I kind of think about when is the next time we're gonna be going to the beach what are you know some of the summer activities vacations coming up so almost like like a little vision board if you will for fitness right. so like maybe like That's take that point. picture of your of your goal maybe just pin it up there for you to see when you wake up in the morning. That's a good way to put it, yeah. I also find that if I get up and I'm like, get up and dressed really early, that helps. Like, as soon as I get up, if I'm like, all right, put it on my workout gear, it's like, all right, we'll do it. Yeah, I um, I leave mine right by the bed, but I have slept in my workout gear before because Ooh. then when I wake up, I'm like, I'm already in it. Daniel right here, I follow him on Instagram. You should all oh, follow him you. at Daniel Hill Media. He's always doing like all these vlogs from the gym. like. I, it's amazing. I have the whole row of people on the treadmill like, guys, everyone sprint right now. And then we all record at once. And you know, you gotta, you gotta work with it. Do you know that um, Taylor Swift video? <laughs> yeah, when she watched the treadmill. <laughs> all these people are just like jumping up and getting off the treadmill, you know, going on those little yeah, like yeah, tracks. Boom. Hilarious. Right Do you have video of that? Thank goodness, oh, no. no. I would actually <laughs> love to make my own version of that Taylor Swift video, because that is a hilarious video. It, it's not hilarious when it's actual real life. No, no, I can people are that. like, Ooh. No, you're right, you're right. All right, so let's go into Crunch and let's see what's going on. We're gonna go on a tour. We're gonna show you all my favorite things that Crunch has that most gyms do not have. Ready? Let's okay, go. Let's go. that's really good about the classes is it starts at a set time. If you're just gonna go to the gym, you're like, oh, who cares if I get there at 7.30 or 7.45, it doesn't matter. But with a class, if it starts at seven, you have to be here at seven, otherwise you're not gonna get in the class. So that really helps too. We're gonna get a workout in right now. 
ever been working out and maybe you can do the 15 pound really easily, but you can't do the 20 pound because it's too heavy and you're like, oh, I wish there was something in the middle. Well, this gym has 17.5 pound weights. Chevy. What do you think of the Equinox? I have to say, it's really nice to drive. I love all the audio features on the dashboard. My wife always blasts the heat and doesn't wear a coat, and I'm always wearing a coat and sweating. I do like the dual climate controls for that. I don't know that the budget will support that, but I really like the idea. I came home and I was like, CR, good news. Water cooler. Like, well, we should talk about things like that before you get. 